Hey there folks, it's Yaken here from Trend Ground. Okay, so in this video, we are going to do the review of this OnePlus 10T. All right, so in Malaysia, there's only one color, the jade green over here. Okay, and uh, yeah, over more than a couple of weeks of uh, testing this device, I do have to say that this is actually the 2022 jack of all trades, master of none device that I think you should be getting it right now. Yeah, reason why? Let's find out more. Come on, let's go. Now, the first thing I want to highlight on this OnePlus 10T is definitely the performance. So powering this device is the Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 and it's paired along with up to 16 gigs of RAM and up to 256 gigabytes of internal storage. From the Malaysian market, we are offered with one variant only, which is the 16 gigs of RAM and 256 gigabytes of internal storage, which I think is going to be lasting a very long period of ownership for Malaysian users and uh, yeah also the device out of the box it is installed with the latest oxygen os 12.1 with android 12 and uh, definitely you can use all the apps no problem not much of an issue and also for day-to-day -day usage whether it is a light usage or heavy usage the performance here is really really good enough and you will not find any issues with that and for those who love mobile gaming you even going to love with the specification over here because it can run Genshin Impact at 60 frames per second and high settings really really amazing uh, I do notice that the game will be hovering around the 50 plus frame rates per second and yeah occasionally there might be some dips but that is normal because most of the devices in the market will also suffer that kind of issue but nonetheless it is capable to deliver high graphic mobile gaming experience for you now the next thing i want to highlight on this one plus 10 thing is definitely the design okay for me i really love the build quality here and the materials they are being used it's really felt premium flagship device okay yeah you could just hand this device to anybody and they were going to tell you that hey this is feeling like a uh, 1000 usd flagship smartphone you know uh but actually it doesn't cost that much in malaysia it's just only like costing 3199 ringgit malaysia which i think the price point is really really good considering with the build quality they are giving over here and also the design of the device it looks similar to the oneplus 10 pro okay which i still love that design okay and uh, the camera bump it doesn't protrude too much as well so that's a plus point as well okay the only downside for this device design is definitely the uh, exclusion of the uh, alert slider yeah i know a lot of people will be uh, complaining about that as well i do complain a little bit because it lost the oneplus identity but do i really like crazily miss that feature not so much because most of the time when i wanted to silent the device i'm going to turn on the screen uh i'm going to swipe down and uh, select silent mode yeah i'm used to that i'm still not too used with the uh, alert slider button just me okay i'm not sure about the others but it is what it is moving on next i definitely have to cover the battery department on this oneplus 10t packed with a 4800 milliamp battery over here is definitely capable to last you throughout the day and if you're someone that is a heavy user you don't even have to worry as well because this device supports 150 watt super work charge and that is crazy and oneplus is kind enough to provide you the cable and the charging adapter as well yeah somehow my sample review unit is a 160 watt super work charger yeah that's like man it's crazily fast and you don't really have to like wait so long to charge the device yeah downtime is definitely reduced significantly with this 
OnePlus 10T. So if you're someone that loves to use your smartphone for entertainment or maybe listening song, then the display and audio category on this OnePlus 10T is not going to disappoint you. Okay, so first start off with the display over here. It's a 6.7 inch AMOLED display, full HD, uh, and it can refresh up to 120 Hz. I think it's really, really good. And it is also HDR10 plus certified as well. So you definitely can enjoy amazing, immersive viewing experience as well. Okay, and also the brightness on this device is really, really good for indoor and also outdoor as well. So you definitely don't have to be worrying. Wherever you go, you definitely can look on the display without much of an issue. So for the audio department here, it has a stereo speaker setup, which actually sounds really, really nice, loud as well. Okay. And uh, unfortunately, there's no 3.5 millimeter headphone jack on this device, okay? But not a problem, you can use wireless audio devices as well, okay? So here's a clip for you guys to check out. I'm actually testing out the display and the speakers itself. Now here is the part where every people want to watch a smartphone review, the cameras. All right, so let's start off talking a little bit about the uh, specification of the uh, OnePlus 10T cameras. Okay, so at the rear, it has a triple camera setup featuring a 50 megapixel main camera, 8 megapixel ultra wide camera, and a 2 megapixel macro camera. Ugh. And on the front, it has a 16 megapixel selfie shooter, okay? Okay, so let's start off with the real cameras first. Okay, I have to tell you and generally praise the 50 megapixel main camera. It's definitely the best one. You are going to be always constantly using it because the photos come out, the details is really, really nice, amazing, and definitely for that price point, you can't complain much on the main camera. Uh, as for the ultra wide camera, mm, bright daylight, not bad. The photos still looks good, but in low light condition, yeah, it's kind of suffering a little bit, okay? Because of the low megapixel count as well, okay? That is something I felt, okay? And as for the two megapixel macro camera, yeah, I'm not gonna waste any more time. You can just look at the sample and that's it, okay? And as for the front-facing camera, that 16 megapixel do definitely capture amazing selfie photos. Yes, you can use it at any moment. And if you really want to use it in low-light situation, I highly recommend you to use it with the night mode or the flash to enhance the quality of your selfie shot. As for video recording capability, the OnePlus 10T can capture up to 4K 60 frames per second video. But there is a catch. It's only capable to record 4K 60 frames per second video via the main camera only. Okay, the ultra wide camera only can capture up to 1080p 30 frames per second. And also same goes to the front facing camera. Okay, so uh, video capture with the main camera definitely looks amazing. I enjoy shooting 4K videos with this OnePlus 10T, okay? And also uh, the video for the ultra wide camera, I still can accept it, even though it only outputs at 1080p 30 frames per second, but in bright daylight, not bad. Low light situation, that's another story, okay? You're definitely going to see a lot of noise 
uh, and also a softer details as well for the ultra wide video and as for the selfie camera yeah lock max up at 1080p 30 frames per second video uh generally not much to complain not much to praise about it looks okay serviceable uh definitely you will want to prefer to shoot more with the main camera so here are some video samples go and check it out all right folks so this is being shot with the oneplus 10t front facing camera 1080p 30 frames per second so what do you think of the uh, video and the audio quality let me know in the comments <laughs> Alright folks, so now I'm going to wrap things up on this OnePlus 10T review with my final verdict. So in Malaysia, this device is priced at 3199 ringgit Malaysia and it's already available for purchase ever since from 1st September 2022. So now you know why I say this device it is a jack of all trades and master of none. And uh, to recommend this device, it is really really easy. I do highly recommend you guys that if you need a fast performing device with a quite okay camera setup, amazing battery life, uh, fast charging speed, uh, good display and speaker setup, then look no further. The OnePlus 10T here is ready to serve you right now. And if you are from somewhere, other parts of the country, yeah go ahead try and check out this oneplus 10t as well in your local stores okay you're definitely going to love this device and if you're going to buy it for yourself for mobile gaming or maybe for your loved one that loves mobile gaming as well yeah it's going to give you an immersive gaming experience definitely no doubt about that so that's all for my uh, review on this OnePlus 10T. Uh, special shout out thanks to uh, OnePlus 10T for providing this sample loan review unit. Okay, uh, they only provide me for more than a couple of weeks of usage. Okay, uh, however, this is not a paid content. Therefore, there is no editorial input, no final approval is needed for this review video. Whatever I'm seeing here is really based on the more than two weeks of usage on this device. Okay, so uh, subsequent software updates might provide a different user experience. Hopefully you guys know that. And if you're still new to the YouTube channel, hey, please go ahead, subscribe it, uh, share it out, drop some comments, and I'll see you guys on the next one.